June 21st, which falls on Sunday, that's the day before Judy passed away in London in 1969, I will be doing a one-time performance at 2 p.m. at the Annex Theatre, O-N-Y-X, in Las Vegas. It's on Sahara Avenue, and uh, when anybody goes to the official website of the Annex Theatre, mm -hmm. they can see my show listed, and the tickets have to be bought online. And uh, it's not just a show about beautiful songs, but this allows beautiful costumes, and allows narrated anecdotes I do about Judy Garland's life, in her later, later years, along with some of the famous people she worked with, like Marlena Dietrich and uh, Noel Coward and so on. So it's not just for older people. There's a lot of younger people uh, and middle-aged too who know Judy as Dorothy Gale. And then when they come in and I explain that there was more to Judy than Dorothy, they become bright-eyed and say, really? But of course, the old fans appreciate what I do because this is done with love. Your home, you have so many collectibles here of Judy Garland. Can you tell me a little bit more about that? Well, I started collecting Judy since actually since 1970 when I was in San Francisco and things grew more and more as time went on and it has become rather vast. I, I even own some of Judy's uh, musical arrangements mm -hmm. that she used when she sang at the Palace in New York and the Palladium in London, which I use for my shows. I have uh, w one picture that she had in her home in Bel Air with a signed check, mm -hmm. and, uh, uh, and some of the things belonged to her in her home, and other things were obtained through theater lobby cars and theater posters. Theaters are closed now, but I was able to get them. So this performance is going to be one of a kind. Uh, people are invited to come see the show at the Onyx Theater, and that is once again here in Las Vegas, the Commercial Center District on Sahara Avenue. Yes, on June 21st mm -hmm. at 2 p.m., they have to come in at 1.30 because at 2 o'clock the show goes on and nobody can come in. People, most people know how to get tickets online. Otherwise, if they cannot get tickets online, then the same day of the show, there will be somebody there so if they want to be in a better seats, it's best to go online ahead of time and reserve so you, you can have the best seats of the house. Wonderful.